Hey everyone, this is class seventh math chapter ratio and proportion. As per the new edition of Selina Math, this is chapter number seven. In old book, this is chapter number six. So as we have already learned about chapter ratio and proportion in class six also. So without delaying, let's recall the definition of ratio. Ratio is what? Ratio is the relation of two quantities that are same in unit. Means. If I have three kg weight of something is three kg, then I can find its ratio with the other quantity that is already in kilogram. It can be two kg, right? So how I will find the ratio? I will divide these two quantities. Same unit, right? And I am finding there. Uh, the relation between them there are the same units that can be cancelled with each other and we can write it 3 ratio 2 so what is this this is the sign this is the symbol that how we can show the ratio right so in the ratio as I have already wrote this thing in the previous videos of the chapter uh, class 6 sorry and uh, there the first term which comes first that first term so I can write it here just a second yeah the first term that is called antecedent and the second term is called consequent so antecedent, uh, antecedent is also uh, you can remember it by the meaning that the term that comes earlier antecedent means the earlier jo pehle aati hai, that is antecedent and consequent which ko jo hum kisi result ko follow karte hai. means jo pehle aayegi antecedent baad mein aayegi consequent right isme main zyada detail nahi bataungi let's start with the questions because details i have already given in six standard videos so this is exercise 7a in old book this is exercise 6a right koi question change nahi everything is same just exercise number ka hi difference hai. Okay, ji, if we come to the question number one, question number one is easy. So, here how to do a question, but I will do the statement sums. First one is 22 ratio, 22 ratio 66. How we have to write whatever is written first means consequent, sorry, antecedent, 